My name is Peter Olivetti from Boulder, Colorado. I own and design bikes for the Olivetti Bicycle Company. Uh, I built my first bike in 2002 at the United Bicycle Institute in, in Ashland, Oregon. And from there, just started designing bikes, looking for things that I wanted to get out of bikes that I couldn't find in the market. And from there, basically just designed them and started building them. Uh, my shop is here at my house. It's a garage workshop. I live up in the mountains above Boulder, which is really great for the work that I do because it gives me a good place to be inspired by what I like to do, what I like to build, and also it gives me a place to really work out my designs R&D wise. So if I build a bike, uh, I have all the trails and you know roads to climb, trails to ride to really work out the designs that I have. The machines that I run are old manual machines. The two uh, mills that I have that I use most of the time are old Nichols mills. They're from about 1952. Uh, they need three-phase power. Um, being a residential garage shop that I have, uh, everything's single phase. And so I needed a way to get those things to power up. And the American rotary converters have been a great solution to that problem of not being able to get the power that I need directly through the line. So yeah, the three-phase machines are pretty necessary for the work that I do. They're way more rigid than, say, a single-phase machine. Uh, and I need to be within a couple thousandths on my cuts. And having the three-phase converter really allows me to keep to tolerance on that stuff. When the customer comes to me, they're looking for a custom experience. And one of the things that I can do is I can either do measurements for them and create a design based on that. A lot of my clients, because they've already been a cyclist for a long time might have a bike that they really like the fit of but want something different and so I can take the measurements off that bike and then build a custom bike underneath them and then a few other clients will go to actual professional fitter and provide me with a sheet of measurements and I'll again build my design underneath those uh, measurements so they're always getting a custom design that I've put together for them but it might have some other outside sort of metrics that come together for us. So I think what sets me apart is probably how transparent I am. Um, I'm just a little home shop. I can, my clients can come up, say hey, shake my hand. They can come out over whenever they want. Even on my website it says if the light's on, come on in. So I think that really is an aspect that the clients really like is that they can see the design process happening anytime they really want to come by or just, you know, they, they give me a call and I pick up the phone. You know, they're always just talking to me and having that one-on-one -on -one experience. Yeah. So I think one of the misconceptions about custom bikes is that it's for the avid cyclist. But really, it can span a way bigger client base than that. Uh, I've dealt with people that have maybe a back issue that can't get over the bike well enough. Uh, I've even dealt with somebody that has an amputation uh, below the knee. So you, it really covers a wide range of people. And also, um, I try to make sure that I can address as many kind of price points as possible. Um, so maybe it's not the, the first bike you buy, but maybe it's you know that bike that you want to, you're really into it and you want to grow, have a bike that grows with you. Business is really about creating those experiences for people and making somebody have this dream bike or their you know bike for life that they want to have forever. Here at Olivetti Bicycle Company, my goal is really to create great experiences for my clients and give them a bike for life. Being able to achieve that goal for people is amazing.